it's time for a cup of joe. I want to be cup of joe. Morning. <sighs> Alright, so lately I have been on a one bag kick. I've been really excited and interested in the idea of just having everything I own be in one bag, especially because I do a lot of traveling with my job as an instructor, so I want everything in one bag. And I've been binging on videos and trying to find what's the best bag, what's the best bag. So I finally decided on the one I want. It's from Tom Bin. But when I went to the website, the color that I really want it in uh, is not in existence right now. And it's like, don't worry. Uh, we plan for this color to be ready to go out of the factory in 2 to 12 weeks. <laughs> like, seriously? 2 weeks? I could wait 2 weeks. 2 weeks is great. 12 weeks? That's like till Christmas. Like, what? Where in the range that falls, I don't know. The bag's really expensive, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do anyways. So I decided, you know what, why don't I just go to thrift stores and find backpacks uh, and go down to one of those bags. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm actually looking later today to see if I can find any. I'm just going to get a regular backpack to see if I can use a regular backpack if I really do need to upgrade to that expensive uh, kind. Uh, but So before I do that, I decide, I realized I'm really going to have to cut down on the stuff uh, that I have. All my clothes, I really need to cut down on. So, uh, like I said in one of my pur other videos, I started purging, and I have filled this entire... This is all stuff I'm getting rid of, if you can believe that. Uh, it's all just, like, doubles, backups, extras, you know, you name it. It may or may not be in here. And I'm done. I'm just done with having more than one of anything. So uh, I'm getting rid of that trash bag full, and all of my clothes now fit nice and neat into this box. Into this box! Like, <laughs> I never really thought that I would get here. Like, I never thought I would come to this, but it's just like, I'm ready. You know, I just feel ready. Like, this feels so liberating for me. I have one of everything. One sweatshirt, one t-shirt, one polo. The only thing I have more than one of is socks, and that's because I'm not sure how many socks I'm going to need come winter time. Right now, I don't really need any socks besides one pair for work, but I'm going through socks a lot more in the winter, so I'm waiting on that. So that's my clothes all fit into that box, and everything else, like my little carry bag or whatever, uh, that's got uh, my toiletries and a uh, book I'm reading, my Bible, that kind of stuff, is all in this bag. So now... Pretty much everything I own and use on a daily basis is in this box or in this bag. Obviously, I have other things around the house, uh, some miscellaneous items, that, but those are just extraneous things that I don't need or whatever. Point is, I can fit everything in there. I think I'm getting, I'm definitely getting rid of more clothes than I'm keeping, okay? Look at this comparison here. And I'm just so excited, like, oh, it'll be so great to just have everything in the bag. Everywhere I go, uh, it'll just be there. I don't know... I'm not sure that I'll be able to fit everything into a backpack. I'm hoping I will. I'm hoping I find a backpack that is usable for me, something that's not like a princess kindergartner backpack or something, but I try to buy stuff like that from thrift stores because if I just go to like Meyer or Walmart or something and buy like a cheap $20 backpack, it's probably made by um, some poor little child in a sweatshop somewhere, so I don't want to support that. I want to get it from a thrift shop, so I don't know how that's going to go. I'm doing that today. Um, I just wanted to share with you uh, just this part of my journey because I'm just really pumped about it. I'm so excited. I never dreamed that I would get this far. You know, when minimalism, when I started my journey, uh, it was just about, you know, really paring down what I had, getting rid of all the excess. And as I've developed my minimalist journey, as I've gone along and grown so much, I've realized how much excess there is. And... Things have changed from what I used to think of excess to what I think of excess now. So before, <laughs> owning two t-shirts was not excess. That would be madness. But now I see having two t-shirts as excess. Alright, I don't need two. I literally only need one. So my idea is I have one of everything. I even had a backup pair of flip-flops I'm getting rid of. Uh, I just want one of everything. And I was telling Erin about this and she's like, What if something tears or you get something stained? And I'm like then I'll just have to either, if I can't wash it out, then I'll have to go buy a new pair. Not that hard, not that bad, right? I mean, this is this is definitely a doable thing. And she's like, well, what if it's like, 
you have to teach class the next day, and that night something terrible happens, it's stained or something. It's all we, uh, we unfortunately we live in a world of constant, um, constant consumer gratification. So there are 24-hour stores that I can go to if I'm really, really desperate. Um, so yeah, just one of everything, right? Just one. It's so much easier that way. I don't have to worry because my original plan was I was going to have everything in um, a backpack that I used, but then I was still going to keep a bin. I'm at home full of stuff that um, I didn't necessarily use all the time, maybe like off-season or something like that. But now I've decided, no, screw that. Screw that. I'm putting it all in one. So uh, the only thing I'm keeping at home, uh, kind of uh, not really a backup, but um, luxury items, I call them, uh, is two skirts and two pairs of underwear here uh, because um, the only time that I can walk around in a skirt or in my underwear is at home. So home, they stay. All right, but... Uh, and again, those are luxury items that I don't need, obviously, but I think, you know, why not let myself have a few things at home? Other than that, we're getting out of this, so I will keep you updated as to whether well, whether or not I find um, a backpack that fits them or how that goes. This has been your cup of joe. Get you going, ritual. Love you, bye.